The nature of the crime was rape and murder. The date of occurrence was on July 29th, 1994. The, lo the location was in Hamilton, New Jersey, and the victim's name was Megan Kanka. Jesse Temendiquas, who had recently served out his sentence of sexual molestation, then relocated into a home in Hamilton Township. After being approached by an innocent seven-year-old girl named Megan Kanka outside his home, Jesse escorted her into his bedroom, raped, and murdered her. He then threw her body in a nearby park. Police investigators located the body in a nearby park soon after being notified of her disappearance. Only two days later, after Megan was pronounced dead, her mother, Maureen Kanka, was in public speaking out for a state law that, were, that would require community notification any time a child molester was let out of prison. Megan's law went on the books in New Jersey soon after. Temenikwaz went on trial three years later in May of 1997. The jury gave him the death sentence. In 1996, Bill Clinton signed a federal version of Megan's law. This law requires that convicted sex offenders register with the authorities wherever they move.